back everyone, this is Paul Summerfield from Northcraft Analytics. I'm joined by Lee Cullum, our Chief Marketing Officer. And we're here today to talk to you about our Office 365 license usage and analytics. So as we see more companies move towards the hosted SaaS solutions for Office Productivity Suite software, Office 365, G Suite, etc. The need for utilization data at a much richer level is becoming more and more apparent. So out of the box, uh, Microsoft gives you, I would say, a rudimentary level of data analysis in, when it comes to Office 365 utilization. What you don't get is a, a dynamic drill down to a very granular level that you get with Northcraft. So uh, that's what Lee's going to demonstrate to you today. So with that, I'll let him kick into the demo. Thanks, Lee. Thank you, Paul. So let's get with the tour of Office 365 license usage and analytics. Why did we create this product given uh, that there are products already out there that do this and Microsoft has a free you know Office 365 adoption plugin for Power BI. A um, few fundamental uh, use cases or just really I think business value that you're trying to achieve. Um, you've got um, you want to optimize license spend right so um, you need to know not only how many licenses have I purchased, but are we using it and tie those two things together because you have licenses in one place and usage in the other, but I need to look at my licenses and then drill into usage from there um, in order to effectively optimize, govern, and reduce license spend or just make sure it's correct. Um, number two, uh, chargeback reporting. So now we're bringing in uh, data from Active Directory, Azure uh, Active Directory. We want to get departmental level data into the license and usage so that, uh, you know, these various business units, we can, we can charge them back. They can purchase Office, Office 365 through, you know, shared services model through a centralized organization and then, you know, it, it's managed by them. And then we want to forecast. So I don't want to see again uh, 12 months of data. I want to see at least 13 months of data so I can look at July 2019 versus July 2018. And I know that sounds like 12 months and it's a little bit confusing with good old date math, but um, we got to have 13 months of data. And the more the better, really. I mean, the if you can store... Um, you know, three years of data, then great, you know, plus one month. Um, so the more the better. And that's how we get to more accurate forecasting, the more data we have. So again, we have usage data, and this is great for Microsoft that they even give it to you. You know, you've got license data in another, right? And so that uh, I can't drill down, okay? Uh, I can drill up, I can show data, and this is mm, somewhat helpful. At least I've got packaging data. But it's not detailed enough for governing my, um, and optimizing my license spend, really. Okay, so that's where the Northcraft product comes in. We also help you fit it within the context of overall IT, because not only do we have this Office 365 spend, which I'll drill to in just a second, but there's also cloud spend, right, from, you know, Amazon EC2 and Azure instances that we have running in the cloud. So um, we need to manage all of that. We've got our ServiceNow license analytics, uh, our SaaS licensing, you know, um, our standard on-prem, our data center costs, etc. So quite a bit of cost data going on overall in, in large IT organizations, which we serve. But specific to Office 365 today, because that's our focus, right? It's not complicated, but it's difficult. It's simple, but that doesn't mean it's not difficult. Um, and multi-dimensional architecture built on Microsoft BI stack with our integration to the various APIs that are needed, PowerShell scripts running in the background when necessary. That's where we're gathering data from all these different places and putting it together in a simple visualization that you really want to see, okay? So I know how many licenses I have. I've got my different packages. All of this data is filtered, okay? And then 
uh, I, it's connected into the detail so that I can drill into, you know, are they, when was the last time they were active? What products do they have assigned to them? Uh, when was their last login? What's the current cost per month for them? In other words, right here I can see, am I wasting money? Okay. So that, you know, that last login date, if I go, wait a minute, they haven't logged in until March 6th. You can actually call this person. I mean, it's just, um, if, if needed, you can email them. You've got actionable information right here. And that's how you take aggregate to grain every time. And so there are things that look simple, but when you have the data volume that a large organization has, and you have data spread out all over the place, and you can't count on specialized integration APIs. You just want to pr provide to accounting and finance or the CFO or the CIO who's then going to provide it to them the details they need to use for accounting. And um, so it's straightforward uh, what we do, but it's automatic and it follows our pricing model, which is not very expensive and allows you to push off some really complicated BI development work behind the scenes with you know ETL and data warehouse build and cube or oh maybe we'll just purchase another you know unstructured data um, tool <sighs> not necessary Power BI with its support for all of the different connectors and Northcraft with our solutions built on top of the Microsoft BI stack makes it incredibly powerful you can customize it you can create the reports that you need, get them to look exactly the way that you want to, that you want them to look, so that you can move from something that looks like this, um, which is helpful, mind you, um, you know, into the information needed to meet the use cases. You know, we talked about at the beginning, which are optimize your license spend charge back different departments and forecast your license growth using large data so that you have more accurate forecasts. That's all we've got. Thanks for your time.